Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Danica and I'm the Fit Mom Lifestyle on Instagram, LTK and TikTok. And today we have an aloe yoga haul. So I've been shopping at aloe a lot recently and they've had a couple of sales. They had, I think, singles day sale and then Black Friday sale. So I've collected quite a few things. Um, and I've really been loving aloe for their like comfy athleisure pieces. I really love Lululemon as well. If you know my channel, you know that I am obsessed with Lululemon, but I really love aloe specifically for their sweat sets. I live in their sweat sets. Honestly, I feel like lounging around the house. Actually, I have aloe yoga sweats on right now and I didn't even plan that. So I really love their sweats. They're like my favorite. Um, and so anyway, little spoiler we've got lots of sweats in this haul but those have been my favorite i have a couple pair that i've just worn over and over and over and it was time to replace so i'm really excited for today's haul if you love aloe hauls make sure to give this video a thumbs up hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos and let's get into the products okay first thing i want to talk about are hats now I have really been into hats lately. I don't know why, like this is a new thing and I've been obsessed with hats. Um, so I grabbed two in these really great neutral colors. Now I don't have the names of these hats. I was just looking and it doesn't say, but I will obviously always have everything listed below um, with links so you can shop them if you'd like. Um, like I said, they did have these on sale and Aloe does do sales relatively frequently, I feel like. So I would keep an eye out for these things if maybe you want to wait. Um, also, Nordstrom carries Aloe and sometimes they're on sale at Nordstrom. So just want to throw that out there if you're looking for like the best price. You might want to just like cross reference and check other sites so the first one is just this super basic like cotton hat and it just says aloe on it um and obviously you can't really see it because it's black on black but they have this hat in so many colors they have like a black one with aloe and white um a white one with aloe and black and like just so many different fun colors they have like a really cute pink one that i'm kind of tempted to get for summer because I just think it would be so cute. So this is really just a very standard basic cotton hat. Like I said, it has a Velcro back so you can adjust it, um, but not like really technical at all. It's really not for working out. I would just wear this casually. Sometimes like I just want to throw my hair in a bun and throw on a hat. I really find that like when you have your hair in like a messy bun and like some cute earrings and you have a cute hat on like it, it's definitely a, a vibe. So I really like this. Like I said, I just kind of wanted a basic black cotton hat and then this next one is more of like a trucker style hat and this is so cute i love this color i have a couple other items in this gravel color and again i just love the tone on tone and so obviously it says aloe and gravel and i just think it like looks really classy and cute and then obviously it's the trucker version so this is what it looks like in the back but i just love this color so much and i really like this style i have a couple other trucker hats like this from lululemon as well and i I don't know like I said I'm, I'm going through it's like my hat era and I've just been grabbing lots of hats so it's been really fun and it's been a fun accessory so I'm sure this will probably carry into the summer and I'll be wearing them a lot in the summer as well but I've just loved throwing them on like when I'm going to drop off my son at school or whatever it's just so easy and I really love them so that is it for accessories okay now let's move into sweatshirts because you guys like look at this this is just like excessive I, I'm I'm aware okay I have also a sweatshirt obsession I feel like post pandemic I'm just obsessed with comfy clothes like literally when I get not even when I get home okay you know how like people say like oh when I get home I change immediately into comfy clothes and like I'm good to go no when I get in my car from work I change in my car now granted I have like an hour and a half drive home so I just don't want to sit in my work clothes for the hour and a half I want to be in comfy clothes and I'm not kidding you I bring these sweats that I'm wearing like I literally will wear them on my drive home 
so I really just love aloe sweats if you look at my tiktok I film a lot of hauls and I'm like almost always wearing the aloe sweats it's kind of embarrassing and like I said I'm wearing these now and my husband wore another pair to bed because they are definitely like unisex um I think they sell some in the men's section and some in the women's section but I'm pretty sure they're just the same item so like all of these items are definitely unisex so if you're looking for any last minute gifts really for anybody I think that these aloe sweats are so great like I said I can't speak highly enough about them I've probably wear them if not every day like every other day I kid you not like I love these sweats they're the coziest like fleece sweats now they're not like something that you're I mean you're gonna look cute in it because it's a cute like aloe set but it's not like figure flattering whatsoever it's literally just like cozy sweats but all that being said I have tons of sweatshirts so the first style is the one that I'm wearing of course like I said everything will be listed below I believe this is the espresso color now in the sweatshirts I personally like to size up to a large so normally in tops I go between a medium and large and usually in bottoms I'm pretty consistently a medium um, when it comes to like sizes like that so aloe tends to run big um, in my opinion and but so when it comes to sweats I still like going with my bigger size because I want it big and oversized but just keep in mind that aloe does tend to run big so you could definitely go with your true size but if you want it like super cozy and big and oversized and I recommend sizing up one because they're just like so like this is definitely big but I really love it so this style is just called the accolade crew neck I'm sorry yeah accolade crew neck pullover I have a card right here um and like I said, I get these in a large and I have this in multiple colors. So I personally sometimes just love a crew neck, especially when I'm like on the couch. Sometimes I don't want to deal with the hood because I feel like the hood sometimes like just annoys me. So I will literally just throw on this crew neck with my Accolade sweats. I really love the Accolade line. I know they have the Renown line and I've been meaning to try it. I should have picked up some items in this haul, but I didn't. I stuck with what I know. The Accolade line is my favorite. So I love their sweats, the straight leg and the like regular sweatpants. And then the sweatshirts, I also have in multiple styles. So the first one is, um, like I said, what I'm wearing right now, the crew neck pullover. This is an espresso and then I also also have it in black which picks up everything so this is just obviously such a good basic and then lastly I also got it in gravel so love I was just thinking like honestly gravel on gravel with like some black leggings or like the espresso in the gravel like just these are so cute I really love to wear them with like flare leggings or regular leggings or these even look good with like jeans jean shorts in the summer like they're just so cute and comfy and like I said this accolade fabric or these accolade this accolade style does have this like really nice cozy fleece fabric I have had one of my accolade sweats for a year I got them I think like last January so just short of a year and I wore them at least once a week so I honestly have probably washed them I mean once a week okay in the colder months so I probably washed them like 30 times honestly and worn them a ton because sometimes I'll wear them like two or three times before I wash them especially if I'm just wearing them like later in the evening after work and now they're just starting to pill and like get a little bally so obviously they will after like so many washes wears and like when you're walking a lot they will start to pill obviously like in the crotch and stuff and then on the inside they do start to you know get like the fleece starts to get a little bally after a while but like I said I have had and worn it over and over and over for the last year and it's just starting to get a little dingy looking so that's why I wanted to repurchase and get some other colors and things like that because I wear them so much that I was like I need more than one pair like I literally had a black pair in the sweats I wore over and over and over and I was like okay we need to get a couple more pair so the next style in the sweatshirt is the accolade hoodie this color was on the website a while ago and disappeared and then I saw it reappear and I was like I'm grabbing this so fast this is dark cactus and I'm just if you know me you know I really love greens and I'm just obsessed with this like cool tone almost like it's got like like a bluish grayish kind of tint to it and I just love this so this one is the hoodie version but exactly the same like fleece on the inside it's literally just the crew neck versus the um, hoodie so that is the dark cactus color and then I also got it in this beautiful color this one is ivory so this is what ivory looks like which I just think is 
honestly a really beautiful classy looking color so I got that and then the last item that I grabbed is the everyday full zip hoodie it says take it to and from in the everyday zip hoodie a soft fleece favorite that goes with everything it has a relaxed silhouette and front pockets for keeping your stuff secure this is in the athletic heather gray and see what i mean like this is a has a guy on the picture so these are all unisex items and i got this in a large as well and basically my husband and i can share all of these items so like i said he was wearing the sweats the other day and he can definitely wear any of these um sweatshirts as well so this one is just the full zip and oh stuck a little bit um this one is the full zip and i just really kind of liked the gray full zip um this one is not called accolade though it's just called the everyday full zip so i know i got a lot of basic neutral colors but like I said I really really love love these cozy sweats so that is it for tops and let's move into bottoms okay so let's stick with the accolade line so I just remembered I also have one more sweatshirt and um, a pair of sweats I got a sweat set it's in the color cinnamon and it's like this beautiful orange um, I will pop up a picture here if I can find it on the site so I did have that set I actually wore it in my Thanksgiving vlog I'm not sure if that's up yet because I forget the order in which my vlogs are going up but I did wear it for Thanksgiving and it's just like a beautiful like orange sweat set and that was the accolade line so I really love that and that was something that I recently hauled but it's actually I so I wash all of these on cold and then hang to dry so it's actually hanging drying in my laundry room so I forgot about that but I just remembered that I was like wait I thought I had one more pair so um let's talk about the like regular sweats um so these are the accolade sweatpant and this is in the color ivory so i got some to like match and have sweat sets so this is kind of what these ones look like and when i try them on um i'll try them on like as a pair so you can see them together but i just really love these they do have um the aloe logo here on the leg so it's on the left side of your leg um and it just says aloe there i haven't had a problem with it like coming off like i said i do have the sweat pant in a few um colors already so this is what it looks like at the bottom it's just cinch like i said i have this gray color that i'm wearing right now it matches this hoodie so it's in the athletic heather gray and then i have a black pair and then i have like a burgundy pair that's in um it's called cranberry so i really love this like i said i wear these in a medium they're just like super stretchy cozy like really just a very basic sweatpant but they're so cute and like i said i really love this like ivory color i think it's so elegant and i think it looks really pretty as a sweat set like for travel days if you're going on long drives around the holidays or if you're flying i think these with like some uggs look so so cute um now i also have this version is the accolade straight leg sweatpant and this is in the black color and this looks the same on top it's just like a, the same like super stretchy comfy fabric and then the bottom is a straight leg so here's what these look like now these look really cute with like platform uggs i that's how um i will try them on for you but i think they look so cute they elongate your legs um and again just that really soft fleece fabric on the inside and i have all of these in a medium and they do have like the um strings to like tighten them if you want i actually recently had surgery and they were like oh wear super comfy bottoms and i really love these because obviously i can pull them up higher and have them cover my belly button or i can wear them down lower um and so they're just like super comfortable i mean they're just basic sweatpants obviously but they're just really really comfy and i really love them like like i said these have quickly become my favorite sweats and I personally like I used to buy sweats from like Target Old Navy Amazon whatever and nothing wrong with that but I just found that like after a couple of months of washing and wearing they just got like old fast and just didn't hold up and like I said mine my aloe ones are just starting to get messed up like after a year so I know that's still like you know you might be like oh that's not that long but with the amount that I wore them and washed them I feel like I got 
for sure got my money's worth so I personally would just rather invest in a little bit of a higher quality that's gonna last me a little bit longer um, as opposed to buying over and over and like you know I, I just I personally think they're worth it so love those sweats I've got two more items not in the accolade line but let's get into these okay the next item is the muse sweat pant again I got these in a medium now I really love the muse line this is different I feel like this is appropriate for like if you want a sweat set kind of in the summertime or early fall or um, late spring when it's not too cold so this is what the muse line looks like it's like a ribbed fabric so you can see here um, this is kind of what it looks like and it does have the aloe yoga yoga aloe logo is what I was trying to say here um, and it's just in this little square and I just think these are really cute they are like a jogger um, style so this is what the cuff at the bottom looks like I really like the muse line like I said I like to wear these um, kind of in warmer months but like if I still want um, to be like covered so here's what they look like on the inside so they're not fleece at all they're just like this ribbed fabric so I have um, a set um, that I got in the Nordstrom anniversary sale they have like a v-neck cropped crew neck in this muse fabric and I have that in like uh, I want to say it was called oh my gosh it was like a brownish burgundy color um, Oh, cherry cola that's what it was called I really love that one and then I also have it in like a teal color so I have the um, cropped um, v-neck in that cherry cola color and I also have the joggers and then in the teal color I got like a different tank um, from aloe and then I grabbed the muse shorts and I wore the crop tank and the muse shorts a ton in the summer and then I have worn that cropped v-neck they also have a muse like cropped hoodie which is really cute but I like the v-neck because I kind of feel like I can dress it up in fact last year I think it was New Year's I wore I have an ivory colored one and I wore it with leather pants and booties and it was just like a v-neck cropped like ribbed sweater so even though these are kind of like athleisure I personally feel like some of these pieces you can dress up um, and like I said I like this muse set um, I just got the black joggers because I thought they would be cute and comfortable for lounging like in the warmer months but um, I do really like the muse line as well they had a gravel set that I saw a while back and then I saw it at Nordstrom and I kept like putting it off and I never bought it and I'm kind of regretting that because I really love that gravel color but anyway I really do love the muse line if maybe you don't like fleece or you run hot or you want like just a different option so that is really great now the last item in today's haul I'm really bummed about and this is the only thing that's going back and I think this was the most expensive piece so I mean I guess that's a good thing but I was really hoping that these would work out so these are the high waist pursuit trouser it says the high waist pursuit trouser is the one you can't let get away this lightweight woven trouser is sleek with front pleats side pockets and a traditional zip fly closure faux back pockets add a stylish street ready touch pair it with a blazer and a cute statement bra or a crop top so I was really hoping I could wear this to work but I think this is very much street style like there's nothing wrong with it and I think it's cute but it's definitely like bigger and oversized and in my opinion not professional enough for my workplace I think if you're in a more casual work environment you could totally wear these but these just won't work out for my work environment and that was like really what I bought them for so here's what they look like and they do have the zipper fly like they're super nice and um, I just really love how they look here um, and it does have the stretchy back so it's so comfortable and it does have these pockets like it was saying but I just feel like a couple reasons why I can't wear them to work one they're just too baggy which you can see better in the try on it's just too hard to show here um, and they do have like even real belt buckles so I just am like really bummed but they're a little too baggy the second thing is they have the aloe logo where is it they have the aloe logo in a like reflective 
here it is it's on the left kind of like behind the knee but it's in a reflective um like font i wish they would have made it like matte black that would have blended better um just because i feel like wearing these at work it'd be like very obviously aloe and then the last issue is do you hear that like i could just picture myself walking down the hall at work like that would be annoying right so these remind me like the fabric is like a traditional like i've talked about this in a recent video but um like a track sweatpant i was in track through high school and college and like we had like those sweats like you know you know what i'm talking about like the sweat sets that just like swish like the nike sweats that were just like yeah so <sighs> Sadly, these are not going to work for me. I wish they were more of like a cottony fabric and maybe a little bit slim, a little bit like slimmer and that the logo was not in the reflective whatever. Um, but I think they're cute. I think they're cute for street style. I think they would look cute with like a skims bra and a blazer for sure. But that's not what I bought them for. So unfortunately, those are going to go back. Um, but I still think they're cute. So just not for what I want them for. All right, so that is it for today's aloe haul. I hope that you enjoyed it, and if you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know down below what your favorite item was or what you think if you've tried any of these pieces before. I also wanna thank you so much for sticking with me throughout Vlogmas. I know that there's a lot of content going out, but I hope that you're enjoying the videos that I'm putting out, and again, I love to kind of read the comments and see what you guys think. Um, I've been a little slow in getting back to comments. I know I really apologize, but I've been so busy filming and editing so thank you for your comments thank you for watching I really really appreciate you and I will see you in tomorrow's video